one of these guys, whoever, one of these guys going home after this, uh, literally moving out of this fucking town. Um, let's get into it. First guy I'm bringing up the stage, love him so much, does a podcast with Pat Barker called Jeff and Pat Love Sports. Make a loud for the new Cleveland native, Jeff Sewing. Yes! Like, every time I bring you up, I'm always talking about you leaving. Yeah, <laughs> I'm fucking out of here. Are you, are you really leaving this time? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Awesome. You're not going to see me again. Oh. Maybe you will. He will. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> anyway, you got to lay up for a second time. Why again? She asked me if she wanted to do it again before I uh, left. And so uh, we're best buddies. Yeah. I don't know. You know, What do you want? I mean, you want to color a bird or some shit like everybody does? <laughs> no, looks like no. a duck or I some shit. <laughs> and, Let's just get her up here. I have some. I'm losing my thoughts now. Yeah. All right, Jeff. All right, fine. <laughs> Shit. What you was saying? Leah, get up here. 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 Leah, Good to see you. You're battling this guy again. Why this guy again? Well, he's going to move to Cleveland. He said I'm going to move August 31st to Cleveland. What the fuck, Jeff? I don't think he's moving August 31st. Nah, uh, I'm going to be late. They put a deadline. He's like, we have to do it before the end of my <laughs> So here we are. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why I listen to you. I know you. I know you're wrong. <laughs> All right, you too. Um, this is weird. Uh, it's like a conversation in a pharmacy. <laughs> Okay, when you said this was a rematch, did you mean on Bumble? <laughs> I, I don't know. It's a dating app. It's a dating app, Jeff. Uh, all right. One of those five jokes. Why do you look like all the King of the Hill characters? <laughs> Well, it's a fucking good joke. That's yeah, really good. One. That's really solid. All right, it's one round of spot jokes. Who wants to do it first? I'm gonna go first. You're a man. Are we ready for this? Yeah. It's a rematch. Yeah. Yeah. Give the yeah. one more time. Let's roast. Yeah. Ding ding ding! I miss that so bad. I know. <laughs> a lot of people give uh, Leah shit about her looks, but I gotta say. I think she looks pretty great considering how most experiments go at Jurassic Park. <laughs> Dude, you look like if an online university could somehow have a janitor. <laughs> boyfriend is a barber. Eight hours a day, he cuts hair. And the other 16 hours a day, he picks Leah's out of his teeth. It's kind of good. Did you get your pussy? Jeff loves sports so much. He's doing what I call a reverse LeBron. That's when you move from L.A. to Cleveland and no one gives a shit. <laughs> oh, man. Leah Silver, I, I am a huge sports fan. I gotta say, growing up as a Chicago sports fan, it is an honor to be up here roasting the Chicago Blackhawks logo. <laughs> Are you 
you're a terrible friend. <laughs> actually has two jobs. She works full-time at a school, and then part-time she tries to convince Elmer Fudd it's rabbit season. He doesn't say we're fucking Moses. This fucking guy. I'm surprised he even knows so much shit. This guy has so much white guilt. Like, why do you have so much white guilt? Is it because you look like the first guy in the stands to yell the N-word at Jackie Robinson? <laughs> I really wish I would have worn a suit today. <laughs> I actually think you guys really fucked up not putting Leah on season three of Roast Battle. Number one, she is the best battler you have. And number two, people love dog videos. Jeff Ross can't remember your name. <laughs> and it's his name! All he has to do is remember his own name. You two are so good. You can go for Jeff. so much better. You guys fucking, it, the dynamic was there. Uh, you know, and it's, it's been great battles all night, but I, I really think they both had one joke that stunk, like one really bad joke each. Um, <laughs> everyone knows which joke I'm talking about too, because I've got those jokes well. Um, but yeah, I, I really think it's dead even. I call it a try. Okay. Pilot, who's liking this one? Didn't get a vote, but got a friend. <laughs> what a hilarious female way to judge this thing. I don't know, the fans, they're so cool and cute. I don't know, it's great. I love that Jeff didn't have to wait to go to Cleveland to have the sense of self-defeat of someone who's born and raised in Cleveland. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I... And he was like, I have a wife, not a girlfriend. It feels like you've only ever had a wife and never a girlfriend. Uh, <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Republican. Your personality is a Garfield calendar. Uh, <laughs> but I would give it to Leah because he his jokes were really great, but a lot of it was the surface appearance stuff and her stuff, I felt, was more researched, and it felt like the things you know if you were friends more, so I go in. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Super lame. Nerd. One push. <laughs> <laughs> and Frank, who do you like? I have to one? be cordial because I'm industry. That's it. Yeah. Uh, there you go. That's All right, sweet. Yo, I really like what Jeff's wearing. I'm a big fan of his style. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> all time. Uh, no, that was really close. I really dug it. It was also like that. I've heard a lot of Leah's got a big nose jokes, but that fucking logo joke was fucking really, really good. But also that reverse LeBron joke was so fucking amazing. The Jim joke was really good too. It was very unique. Also, I loved your Rose Battle 3 joke. That was sweet. But I have to give it to Leah. That was just real strong. Sweet, baby. Keep it going. Let's leave the game.